Today, I want to show you how to fix the sample island in the new Arc Dev Kit, to test your mods without always having to load the island. To do this, first start the Dev Kit. When everything is loaded, open the Sample Island WP in the Maps folder. If Wildcard does not fix this in a later update, your loaded map will look similar to mine. Black ground texture with trailing light effects. To fix this you need to navigate to the landscape tab and open it. Click on Manage and then select Import. Change to the Export option. Make a check mark at export single file, so you don't get an own file for every landscape proxy. Now select data underscore wetness, height map file, beach underscore sand underscore zero one and shared underscore grass underscore zero one. Make a new folder to save the layers in it. Now name all the selected files. Press the export button. Switch to the paint tab. Select beach underscore sands and select the layer info file. Do the same with grass. Delete the last two layers. Go back to the Manage tab and then to Import. The height map and wetness should be selected, also select Sands and Grass. Now select the correct file with the appropriate name that we have just exported. After you hit the import button, the dev kit needs some time to calculate shaders. Now you can switch back to the selection mode. You now should have a normal ground texture, it can take some time until the ground clutter spawn. I recommend saving beforehand, as sometimes the dev kit crashes at startup.
Now hit the play button and test. Now you can test all your mods, with a lot shorter loading time on a small test island. 